Okay, so in this lesson, we learn how to reference articles using the Vancouver style. As you know, in Microsoft Word, by default, we do not have a Vancouver style. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is before you start, let me close Microsoft Word. Let me just save this file. And the first thing you do is go into File Explorer and going to view and make sure that the file name extension and the hidden items is on okay that's the first step once you've done this what we need to do now is we need to download a file called Vancouver style file okay so to do that you can either go to the links given below and download the file and the first link is is this one over here and just go to your Explorer or to your Chrome and go to the file and that's the file that we have to download click on download and download anyway and automatically it will download the file we'll say keep and there you go that's the file that you need okay in case you want to download it from github.com that's the link okay let's copy this and let me go here enter okay and once you come to this one this home page click on raw and highlight everything I'll press ctrl a and highlight everything copy it control C once you have copied it what you can do is open up notepad and paste it over here control B and then save it anywhere you want I'm gonna save it on the desktop and I'll call this Vancouver dot xsl click ok and now your file is saved right on the desktop I've saved it on the desktop okay next what we need to do is we need to copy this file to the appropriate folder and depending on what version of Microsoft Word you're using you need to copy it according to that uh, directory so I'm using Microsoft Office 365 so I'm going to copy it within the style folders or the bibliography folder and the link is given so let me start up file explorer again and I'm going to go into my C drive within C drive you have go into your user users Nabil and go into app data go into roaming Microsoft bibliography and style that is where we need to copy the file that's the file I'm just going to copy this control C and come here and paste it okay now the first part is done which is downloading the file now let's start up Microsoft Word and that's my research now as you can see within the references you will have The Vancouver style showing okay now <clears throat> once you have the Vancouver style showing now we need to insert a reference now to insert a reference there are different scenarios let's take the first scenario in which you want to just insert it in a simple way let's say I come over here and I say select Vancouver style and insert a citation okay now remember if you have not created your citation you need to go into manage sources okay and you have to um, create or say new source and define your sources over here if it's from a book select book and enter all the details and if you need more information or need more fields for your bibliography just click on this one and add or fill in up all of these okay all the ones at least the ones that you have okay so since I have already created mine I'm just going to say cancel to this 
and these are the ones I have created I'm going to use all of them so I'm just gonna highlight each one of them and I'll say copy okay once this is copied it will be available available for my current research I'm gonna say close and now if I click over here you can see that they're all available okay now to insert a reference just go to where you want to insert it click over there and say insert let's say I want to insert this one over here okay same goes for this one I want to insert one here right after this that's the one I want to insert and another one here okay so this is the first scenario in which you just want to insert uh, a simple reference okay the second scenario is in which you have more than one reference that you want to show over here okay in that case what you need to do is let's say I have another reference that I want to show so I'm going to click over here right inside the parentheses and within this I'm going to say insert this one as well and that is the way it will be inserted okay otherwise if you do not do that if you click outside or okay if you're here and you insert another one that is the way it appears although that's the way it should appear okay so in case that happens you know you can just go ahead delete it click how do you delete it just click on these three buttons over here or these three dots press delete and it should go away okay then you can insert it again uh, let me delete this one as well click on the dots delete and I'm going to insert one let's say this one and click in the parentheses within your reference and then say this one maybe okay okay in this in the third scenario you have for example okay now once you have done this you also would want, want to insert your bibliography or your reference and to do that you need to go into bibliography and you can say either reference or bibliography I'm gonna say bibliography and there you go let me just minimize this so you can see what's happening okay now so the first one the first reference that's shown should be as number one the second one it'll show as number two the third one that you use will be number three so on and so forth now in case you decide that you want to change the order of the references so in, to do that you have to first delete this okay let's say this is the one I want to use first I'm gonna say Microsoft Corporation this is the one okay and let's say over here I want to insert another one maybe this one okay now once you do that remember that the first one that you use should show as number one okay so what you do is if you make some changes over here just come over here and this will once once you click update citation and bibliography this will automatically arrange itself so I'm going to say update and now Microsoft is showing as number one which is right over here okay okay how do you delete a bibliography in case you want to delete a bibliography again click here and again the three dots press delete click again and it goes away okay sometimes it disappears in the first shot when you press delete sometimes you have to do it again okay you want to insert it again just click here and sorry over here and say bibliography and there you go so that is how you insert um, the Vancouver style of referencing in Microsoft Word thank you very much for watching